The Dade County Band is still healing. They lost one of their seniors in a deadly car crash nearly three weeks ago. Good evening. I'm Josh Rowe. And I'm Latricia Thomas. They're picking up their instruments to pay tribute to 17 year old Lexi Moore. Kylie Thomas has their story. Today marks the first time the Dade County High School Band performed since losing one of their seniors. They say three weeks ago performing seemed unimaginable, but now they're using their talent at music to heal. The halls in Dade County High School are quieter than most remember. It's still not normal. It's never going to be normal because she was such a big part uh, of everyone's everyday life. Sarah Kelly looks at the empty chairs where she and Lexi Moore used to sit. I sat with her while we watched our talent show that day and I had practice with her. But instead of hurting in silence, the Dade County Band is healing in the best way they know how. Their talent takes over at their first concert since Lexi died unexpectedly as a passenger in a car crash. She was a senior, a member of Color Guard, and an expert in kindness. If I came to school and I was having a bad makeup day, she'd, hey, she'd be like, hey, turn that front upside down, we have some eyeliner, here's your highlight, and then she'd move on. Brianna Nobby says playing this hymn has been therapeutic after losing her friend. It really helps because it made you feel like you're just so much you're closer together and it makes you feel like you're just healing as a whole. So whether it's three weeks or three years from now, this will never be easy. It will only get easier. The Dade County Band will never stop talking about Lexi, allowing music to heal the bad days and remember the better ones. The students and staff here at Dade County High School say the other two students who are in that car are still recovering in the hospital tonight. Reporting in Dade County, I'm Kylie Thomas. Lexi's mother says they are raising money for a scholarship fund in Lexi's honor. She says her daughter has a or was a bookworm with a straight A student. Family plans to award one Dade County student with a scholarship each year to donate to the cause. Go to our website. It's newschannel9.com.